Hello, the kids, and it's I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of New Vegas. All right, when we left off, I uh, got a big old plot dump from Ulysses, and then directly after that, I get attacked by Markmen, as you can see by the flares in the sky. So, uh, they're coming to get me. Right now. Somewhere. <laughs> I'm not entirely sure how they're going to get at me, but I know they're uh, coming for me. How much I know. Um, they're all down there from the look of it, and, uh, quite frankly, my spot... Oh, I'm spitting everywhere. I have soda now, so my body's gonna react accordingly. <laughs> um, one of the ways I can get down there is down that way, but I know if I try pot-shotting them from here, it's not going to go well, so... I'm not going to even try it, really. Uh, i got the white thing here. Which means there should be stuff up here. What is that? Ooh. Rockets. Thank you. Thank you. That is very good for me. Um, nothing else I'm seeing that's really worthwhile. Uh, at this point, I might as well run this. But I'm not running the jacketed hollow points for these guys. These guys actually have armor, and pretty good armor at that. So, well, maybe if I try it this way. Um, huh. I know just exploding that won't help me. I know that for a fact. Maybe if I shoot from here. There's a couple of walk... There's a couple of people walking up right from here. And they're just moving around down there from the look of it. Huh. I wonder if maybe... No, I don't have any explosives, do I? No, I do not. I do not have any explosives. Okay, well. I wonder if maybe if I do blow it up. I wonder if it would have any effect on them. And... No. Yeah. It did. <laughs> oh, that's beautiful. Oops, I hit the wrong button. Yeah, blew them up. Blew them sky fucking high. Beautiful. Okay. According to Eddie, we have people coming at us. Please don't knock me off the edge, Eddie. Please don't. Please don't do that again. <laughs> That's too high a drop to fall. Oh, I'd be deaded within seconds. Oh, jeez, Eddie, quit doing that. Please. I should just fucking make it down here. There we go. Oh, thank God. Alright. Courier 6. Yes. Yes, I am. That is a backward 6, though. It's more like a 2, if anything. Alright, there's something down there. Eddie, please stop it. Okay, that's... A death claw? That's something. Is that a dog? Can't tell from here. Looks like a death claw or something animalistic. Wait a minute, is that a mole rat? Are you kidding me? That has to be a mole rat. That's fucking stupid. Okay. There's something over here. Which is very useful. You're excited, beeping. That's always a good sign. Alright. Got flashbangs. Oh, these are good. These are what I need. The rockets, not so much. But. There's another Ulysses log. Hey, hey, hey. And we're going to listen to that almost immediately. I uh, haven't listened to this one yet. That's weird. Could have sworn I did. Big empty. There's something hidden there. A crater. Past wind and sand. So deep in the desert. There's no turning back. Finding the crater was an accident. Was following the weather patterns. The divide sky torn like that. Man's violence, not nature's. True. That violence in the sky had a source. Tracked it, like following a river current. Left the colors to mark my way, like always. In case someone finds them, learns the pattern. The courier might. But I thought sand and wind would never end. Came to the crater. And there, there was an old world facility. A weather station at the edge, still 
raking the sky with electricity and generators. And beyond it, saw the rest of the old world hell there, all carved up like garden plots. Had to see what was there. Couldn't leave it be. Things sleep in the big empty. The Brotherhood woke them up. Can't move quiet any more than the two-headed bear can. And when they woke up, it was like all of history waking up at once. Almost didn't make it out. Almost. Left with answers I never intended. That was talking about his time in the Big Empty. The Brotherhood, I assume, is Father Elijah, who came in before him. And a lot of that, a lot of that touched on uh, stuff that he did. We saw his flags and everything around there, so we know he was there. Ooh, got some good stuff here. A lot of good stuff, hello. But, uh, he apparently left with answers he never intended, which was the question he asked the brains that they subsequently erased from their memory banks because they weren't actually supposed to tell him something like that. But he got the answer nonetheless. And, uh, yeah, th I was right. Those were mole rats. Could probably take them out easy. There we go. That's one. Yeah, I see the other one. It's right over here. Looking for its head to poke out. There we go. I expected two shots would take. <laughs> it would take two shots, rather. Uh, don't know why I want Yoda there. But uh, I expected it would take two shots because the other one took two shots. Mainly to find the fucking hitbox. Alright, we got some stuff in here. Yeah, so he went to the Mojave... Not the Mojave, the Big Empty, because he noticed similar sort of, you know, weather disturbances that he saw in the Divide after, well, the actions that happened here. Ooh, thank you. So he decided to figure out what the hell's going on over there, and he found uh, quite a bit was going on over there. So he had to, uh, he just had to keep moving. Figuring out what was going on. Oh, jeez. It says that there's more of them over here, but I'm not seeing them. Are they up here? Maybe. I don't know. I can't really see. Anyway. So, he discovered there was shenanigans going on. And then he learned things he wasn't really supposed to learn. Probably helped him form his opinion now as to what my actions were, or what they could have meant. Either or. Alright. Let's just keep on moving. Eh, none of these are worth it. Fuck it. Okay. We're down on ground level. Without actually dying, which is good. That's always a good thing. You end up on ground level and you didn't have to uh, fall a thousand fucking feet. Ooh, got some good stuff. Uh, not gonna pick those up. Those are detriment to my health and to, well, my weight. <laughs> that too. Alright, um, pick that up. Pick up the Wonder Glue. Is there something? I see a duffel bag. I am seeing a duffel bag because that's what I'm seeing. Haha. <laughs> Ooh, this is locked. Why is the file cabinet locked? Is there porn in here? Is there things they didn't want other people to see? Lad's life and true police stories. Well, I was close. <laughs> okay, we got some good stuff here as well. Thank God. All right. We are down here and... Come on. There we go. We got some pre-war money. Always good. Ah, I didn't read that as empty until I already hit the button. Filing cabinet. Uh, Wonder Glue, perfect. Desk, what do we got? Dirty water, perfect. Good stuff, good stuff, alright. Now, we've taken out a good portion of, uh, people already. I'll take these, thank you. Because I can use them for stuff. Taking a good portion of Markmen out already. 
but there's still more Dad. I gotta do. Hey, Dad! Check out this robot I found. Careful, Tommy. I've never seen a robot like that before. It might be dangerous. He's not dangerous. Look, he's hurt. Can we take him home, Dad? Maybe Mom can fix him. I don't know, son. What if someone comes looking for it? Please. He looks so lonely. Maybe if Mom fixes him, he can help her out around the garage. <sighs> All right, boy. But if he breaks anything, it's coming out of your allowance. Yay! He'll be just like Ralphie. Only this one's not a toy. Huh. Where did this happen? Better question, when did this happen? How did he know about Ralphie? Huh. Sounds like the kid was pretty fond of you. Why did you leave? Oh, yeah, because you still had to continue Whitley's mission. You still haven't made it to Navarro yet. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, okay. You were very ripped and raring to go to complete that mission. Gotcha. Where did this happen? Illinois. So that's where you got that plate. The other you, I mean. What's a Chicago? <laughs> I know what a Chicago is. What's a Chicago? <laughs> I had to. I had to. Come on, let's go. Alright. There is a couple of them around here, but I'm not seeing them immediately. Maybe they're inside the building. Um, what is that? Okay. Yeah, there's there's something moving inside the building. I'll need to deal with that when I get in there. Alright. It's good that this scaffolding area-ish thing was here. Let's me uh, move to and from the building. Okay. I'm not seeing anything down here that's worth looting. If I blow that up, what do you think it would help me against them? Don't think so. Huh. He's carrying something big. I think he's carrying a blade of the west. Oh, this guy's out here too. I see him. If I can take him out. There we go. He's down? Oh, he was carrying a plasma. Uh, something. Whatever the fuck that is, I don't know. But it's a big weapon. That's all I need to know. Okay. So he's over there, which means I can... Shit, he's moved just out of shot distance now. Wait. There we go. That was beautiful. What are you doing that music for? They're not coming for me yet. They don't even know where I am. Yet. Key phrase. Alright, I'm just waiting for one of them to poke out from a spot that's covered so I can actually shoot at them. I saw him move over there. There he is. I cannot hit him from there. But maybe... Shit. I missed. I missed. Come on. Damn, I got a couple hits on him, but not enough. Okay. This guy's still moving around up there. Okay, so he's making it his way down here. There we go. Ooh, got him right in the head. Good shot me. Trying to get hit him, but he's covered by that building. There's no way I'm going to be able to get a good shot on him. Damn it. See? See what I mean? He's covered by that building. You keep doing those music sounds. I don't think you know what caution means. It means that they aren't going after me yet. Eddie. You doofus. You damn doofy robot. Oh, there's some ammo over here. I'll pick this up for sure. Got some flashbangs. Hello. I'm getting too many flashbangs. That's what I'm noticing. I'm getting way too many of them. 
They're useful up to a point. Okay. He's, he's not poking out enough for me to get a good shot on him. <sighs> Eddie, I'm going to need you to carry some things. Mainly the flashbangs, because I have way too many of them. And the BB. Nah, I don't need to have him carry the BB gun. That's, that's not even weighing all that much. This, though. All of these. Uh, let's have him carry ten of them. There we go. Um, don't think there's much else I need to give him. Um, yeah, I don't think there's much else. So, let's have him deal with some things. Um, like making some ammo. Why not? Sure. I <laughs> uh, need some more of those for damn sure. Alright, and... Let's... Yeah, let's make some more, uh... Make some more jacketed hollow points. Okay. Um... And let's break down these to make m some more semi-wad cutters. Why not? Let's get that done real quick. And easy-like. There we go. And beautiful. Alright. And... Let's deal with those, um, yeah, let's deal with these, ooh, uh, I have enough to do it, but at the same time, I kind of don't want to, unless it's worthwhile, like, seven, <laughs> um, fuck, ooh, I can make a doctor's bag, beautiful, I could use that, I could definitely use that, and let's make some more stuff. Let's make these into microfusion cells. Um, let's make the small energy cells into... Yeah, let's do that. There we go. I think that was my phone beeping. Because it's finally recharged to full. Probably. I assume. <laughs> um, let's make those max charge. Ooh, I can make a super stim pack. Hello. Didn't know I could do that from here. Um, I'll definitely make these repair kits first. And that'll deal with most of my weight. And then I'll make the super stim pack. Maybe. Nah, let's wait. Let's wait on that. Wait on that until I know. Let's wait on that until I know I can make multiple. Ooh, got a bag here. With banana yucca fruit. Ah, good enough. My buttons are clackety today. Those rockets. Let's give those rockets to Eddie. That's the thing I'm pretty sure he's carrying a lot of. No? Huh. Well, that's something I'm going to have to change. Uh, get those out of my inventory because those are weight I do not need. There we go. Well. Since we dealt with the majority of combatants here, that's still from the nuke that fires, so that's to be expected. I should probably... Oh! I should probably heal all of that now. Ah. Ha ha. Ow. That hurt a lot. Jeebus. Okay. Good thing I made a doctor's bag. Oh, jeez. Freebie. Okay. And let's pop a couple stim packs. Oh. Owie Ow, ow, ow. I did not expect that. I should have. Whoa! The fuck was that? That wasn't me. This time. Okay. Well, uh, incendiary grenade. And a super sledge. Sure, definitely. I'll take that. Alright, another Markman Ravager with no leg left. Oh, that was from the other guy, okay. Well, in that case, um, wow. These guys got deadlit. Got deadlit hard. Oh, I didn't know they carried anti-material rifles. And that's misspelled. Again. We saw that in the 
honest hearts as well. Ah, that's annoying. Okay, I'm gonna take those. And I'm gonna take that. And I'm gonna... Nah, I don't need to take those. We'll take those, though. God, these things are heavy as shit. Okay. Got a riot shotgun, which is pretty good. Um, I'll take... Actually, those are slugs. I'm not gonna be able to break them down. I'll take the frag grenade, though. Uh-oh. 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 He sees me. Wait, what? Someone else sees me. Oh, no. Okay. Okay. Okay, this is not good. I am over-encumbered right when they start to attack me. It's not good. Come on, hit the head, please. Thank you. Jesus. There we go. There you're down. Oh, shit. Come on. Come on. There we go. Oh, shit. <laughs> this guy's coming in. Oh, no. Can't let you live. Oh, thank God. Eddie's on fire. <laughs> oh, jeepers. <laughs> oh, no. This is going so many different ways of bad. Uh, snake bite tourniquet. I don't really need to deal with poison all that much anymore. I think with uh, the Heartless, I pretty much eliminated the ability to be poisoned. But I will get that slasher. That slasher is a good thing. Okay, good lord. There's so much fire here. Oh, jeez. Oh, my god. Alright, I'm gonna need to fucking head back. <laughs> Cause shit. Things have gone south. My inventory is full up. And there is a lot of dead bodies around me. This is marked, right? This little spot over here? Yeah, that's marked. Uh, okay, jeepers. Actually, I can probably give all this stuff to Eddie. Or at least some of the heavy stuff. Um, like the material rifle. That's heavy enough. Um, where's the fucking riot shotgun? Ah, that's not really that heavy. To be perfectly honest, the sledges, though. Um, I can probably use that to repair the survivalist rifle now that I think about it. So that would actually be in my best interest to keep. Uh, Blade of the West, I'll take that. Okay, and let's go back to Eddie. I'm pretty sure I can repair that with the sledge. Pretty sure. I'm pretty sure, but I'm not entirely sure. Because I am never entirely sure. Uh, Blade of the West was up here, and I'm pretty sure that was more valuable than the Super Sledge. I'm pretty sure. Again, I'm never entirely sure. Because that's just me. <laughs> never sure of anything, I say. Because anything I say can and will be wrong. Alright. Reloaded already. Good. That's good. Again, more explosions. Why with the explosions? Why with the explodins? No more explodins, please. <laughs> please, no more explodins. I don't need more explodins. It's too many explodins. <laughs> ah, what did I say about explodins? <laughs> Ow. That hurt. A lot. My limb's broken. Again. Ah. I can deal with my chest, too. And another dozen stim packs. Jesus fuck. Oh, please don't tell me there's more. Okay. Bodies. I can deal with bodies. Plasma Defender. Is that what the big... No, that's... That's a whole different kettle of fish. The big thing was over here. It's a Plasma Cutter, I think. No? It's not telling me... It was picked up? It was picked up by someone else. Who the... Who the dicks? It must have been the people who were firing at me over there. It must be on one of their bodies. Huh. At least I hope so. Otherwise, what the fuck? I know I saw something. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I'm desecrating bodies all over the place. Okay, I'm quite a bit over time. I should probably end the episode here for right now. But I just want to loot. I want to loot and get things. Because looting and getting things is good. 
for me. Mainly for me. <laughs> anyway. Fuck it. I'll just end the episode. And I gotta deal with all this stuff anyway. Gotta drop it somewhere. Ooh, I, I should take that scalpel. Now that I think about it. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. Click the like button if you like this particular video. Oh, great. I'm overburdened. Share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see y'all in the next episode. This has been the one and the only Stray Cat. Playing games and constantly getting overburdened because I am beating the fuck out of these motherfuckers. And taking all their shit because their shit's pretty damn good. Well, I say shit. I mean equipment for you.